Well, hi, and welcome to another LRCC soundbite. I think there's always something very reassuring when you trust someone. You know that they've got your back. Maybe it's someone you work with. I've got people that I've worked with for quite a number of years. They really know me and I really know them. We work together pretty well, we think. We know each other's strengths and weaknesses. We look out for each other. If one of us is feeling low, then we're there alongside them. If things are going well, we celebrate together. When one of us is finding times hard, we all help until we've got that situation sorted. I was reading a story about Jesus this week where he demonstrated just how closely he was looking after his disciples. You might remember a few weeks ago now, I talked about Jesus in a boat with his disciples. At the time, Jesus was asleep in the back of the boat when a huge storm came that was big enough to sink the boat. The disciples were scared. Eventually they woke Jesus up and Jesus simply told the wind and the waves to clear off and all was calm. Unsurprisingly, the disciples wondered, who is this man? Well, this week we find the disciples in a boat again. It's not surprising really. A lot of Jesus' ministry was around Lake Galilee, which was a pretty big lake. It was a, It's about 13 miles long. It's about eight miles wide. And on this occasion, the disciples, several of whom were fishermen, so were used to boats, have headed off back towards their home since Jesus had taken himself off to pray and would probably be gone all night. As it turned out, Jesus didn't pray all night and he did come back down to the lake at some point on his own. That's fine. By this point, the disciples were about halfway home. And again, the wind is starting to blow and things are getting quite rough on the lake. As they're rowing and trying to keep the water out of the boat, they see something rather strange, something scary. Someone is walking towards them, walking on the water. This is not normal. They are scared, but the figure shouts across to them, don't worry, it's me, it's Jesus. The disciples are mightily confused, and as he gets closer, they try to get him to join them in the boat. But then they look around and see they've, got, they've arrived. They're back at the harbour at home. Somehow the second half of the journey happened without them seeing it. Jesus is with them and now they are in the right place at just the right time. They're safe. There's no more problems with strong winds. Jesus had their back. And in the same way today, I'm convinced that whatever I do, wherever I am, whatever I'm doing, Jesus has got my back. Jesus has got the back of everyone who has accepted him. Life is never easy. It will never be easy. There are always going to be strong winds. There are always going to be storms. But I know that I'm safe. And when the chips are down, whatever is needed for me to do what I need to do and be in the place I need to be, Jesus is there to make sure it happens just right. I'd be really happy to talk to you more about my experiences and how this seems to work for me. Do feel free to email or and ask or come along and see us any Sunday afternoon. We'll be here on the driveway of number 44 Lindbergh Road between 2 and 5. Come and enjoy a drink and something to eat and whatever you want to talk about we're here to talk and chat and enjoy each other's company. I do hope I'll meet you soon. For now, God bless you, have a great week and I'll see you next time.